My name is Jen Corbridge and I am the Public Partnerships Manager at Propel and we are a mission-driven technology company that builds modern, respectful, and effective technology that helps low-income Americans improve their financial health. And the principal way that we do that is through Fresh EBT. And Fresh EBT is a smartphone app that allows anyone with an EBT card to easily check and manage their SNAP balance. So the problem, prior to Fresh EBT, SNAP customers had to dial a 1-800 number, enter an EBT card number, which is like 16 digits, follow all the prompts, often in the middle of a grocery store, shop with kids running around just to find out how much they have to spend. And given uh, that 71% of low-income Americans have a smartphone, we found it interesting that few financial tools were being developed to, for their needs, and specifically for those receiving government benefits. <clears throat> so the solution, we created Fresh EBT, and that is a tool that makes checking and managing your SNAP balance just a click away, not having to call the 1-800 number is easier, more modern, and more discreet for households using government benefits to track and manage their finances. Next slide. So in addition to making it, making it easier for households to check their SNAP balance, we also use Fresh EBT as a point in time to connect with families with relevant and useful resources. So this is ways to reduce costs and save through coupons and special offers, and jobs to increase income, leading ultimately to greater financial stability. For example, in this slide, SNAP households that use Fresh EBT are able to extend their benefits an extra two days, which at that three week mark is not nothing. Fresh EBT is available in, for free in all 50 states and territories and is currently used by 4 million SNAP households. Our users tend to be a bit older to be female and to have school age uh, children in the home. Okay, so yes. I'm going to try it. Yes, I'm going to try and share my screen too. Thanks, Jen. Sure. No. Let you know as soon as we see your screen. Can everyone see my screen? Oh, no. Why? Not quite yet. Yeah, no worries. There we go. We're in business. Okay, great. So I'm just going to kind of give you a, a, a brief demo. So anyone could download Fresh EBT for free from either the Google Play Store or the App Store. And you enter your five digit zip code to find your location, to create an account, and you enter all the relevant information to create your account. And I'm just going to uh, log into a dummy account so you can see the features in the app. And so that once you log into the app, it brings you into the main page where you can see the food stamp balance uh, and the various features, the spending history of where you've shopped at last. And there's a manage, save and earn feature alongside a couple of just for you features at the bottom. We also have a benefit programs update in Georgia, which is where I am, where you can access, where SNAP households can access information about program updates, which given COVID, there have been a lot. Help for renters being one of those things. We partnered with a tool to help it make to help make it easier for SNAP households to access the CBC declaration. And then finally, we go into the save uh, feature where there are uh, a number of ways to save, and you can click on the see all coupons for stores in Georgia where those coupons are available. And finally, the earn page where you can apply for jobs right right in the app within five miles of Athens, Georgia, which is where I am. And finally, we have a map that basically shows anywhere where you can use your food stamps, whether it's at a supermarket or a farmer's market, where the food pantries are, et cetera. And that is a brief, a brief sort of overview of the app. And so I would be remiss if I didn't sort of mention the pandemic in more detail and the disproportionate impact it has had on low income households across the country, particularly on families with school age children. And I'm sure many the work has changed for many folks participating in or attending this conversation today. So we started receiving many questions from Fresh EBT users when the first of the relief packages was passed. And we realized that Fresh EBT was well positioned to help communicate the rapid succession of policy changes, whether that was about SNAP 
or housing or utility shut off moratoriums, all of these programs being sort of crucial to the lives of low income households. Next slide. And so given that it became clear that a benefits policy update feature was needed and necessary. So in the first two weeks of March, we stood up the COVID help center. And this is a feature that tracks and distills uh, benefits policy information so that families can plan their financial lives with the most up-to-date information 